All right, this is Andrew Jolly with Joda Home Inspections. We're here today at 2293 Benchmark Circle in Salt Lake City doing a sewer scope. Today is May 21st, 2020. And we've got the camera pushed out 80 feet. And you can see here on the screen that there's something blocking the line. Uh, most likely a root. This looks like some sort of a, a transition point where there's probably two pipes connected together. And that's where roots like to uh, crawl in and then they'll get bigger since they have access to the water and they'll continue to grow. Now the issue is that things can get caught on that root just like it is doing here on the screen. Uh, it looks like toilet paper that's caught on it. I'm not able to get past this spot. Uh, my camera head's just running right into it. And so this is as far as I'm able to go with my camera. I'd recommend having it cleaned out and then uh, after it's cleaned out, you can have the rest of the line looked at. We're going to pull it back now and record it and see what else we find. So this is a plastic line, which is good. Uh, PVC, that's what they still use on most new construction. You don't have a lot of the issues with plastic lines like you do the older types of pipe like clay or cast iron. One of the things I'm looking for is any standing water which would indicate improper grade. But this is looking good. I'm not seeing any standing water. So far the most noteworthy thing has been that root. And roots are just maintenance items. Um, once you have roots, you're always going to have it. There's a couple ways to remove it, but I'd recommend probably having it hydro jetted. That's going to get out everything, and then also they'll usually um, include a camera for you when you hydro jet it. Uh, there's a clean out, and so this is an access point somewhere in the yard. Uh, I didn't see one out there. It could be buried. Trying to see if that's a separated joint, but I don't think it is. And having it cleaned, I would say, just have the, the drain specialist put their eyes on it and get their opinion about that that joint, just to be sure. This is ABS. This is just a different type of plastic line. A lot of times you'll have ABS in your house and under your house and then once it goes through your foundation outside uh, it's, it's PVC. So just to recap I only got out 80 feet and so there's some area of the line that I'm not able to see but I recommend having it hydro jetted or cleaned in some way to get that root out and then having the rest of the line looked at. So I'm going to end this recording now.